Hey guys, how you doing tonight? So I wanted to shoot a quick video for you guys to kind of go over the nutrition plan um, uh, for uh, the master's hammer and chisel where you can find some things. Uh, if you're like me and your program has not arrived yet and you have on demand, you can still get access to, this, to these things. Uh, so for instance, you can hit up the calendar and to look at the workout schedule uh, here, which is a pretty nice calendar. Um, but what I'm interested in is the program and nutrition guide. So you can just click this and download it as a PDF. Uh, I've already done that. And so here it is. And I just want to go over it and a few things for you guys specifically talking about nutrition. Um, so when you open it up, here's the title page, kind of an intro into the program and then uh, what's in the nutrition guide. So you have things about the program and then nutrition. Uh, so the first thing, everyone wants to know, well, what's my calorie goal? And while, since I've talked to most of you about this already, you probably have a pretty good idea about what you need to do, but uh, if you don't know, uh, there's a couple good ways that you can get about figuring it out. Uh, one thing that I like to do is I like to track my food with my fitness pal, and just by trial and error, you can figure out the... Um, calorie goal that works best for you just um, by picking one that should be pretty close and then see how you go after a few weeks and then make adjustments every few weeks until you get it right. Um, but if you're looking for just a quick thing, this is probably a good place to start. So for instance, they ask you a few questions to so go through and answer and collect your points. So for example, I'm a guy, uh, that's plus two. For me, what's my weight? I'm right smack in the middle of this range here at um, 180 to 200. I'm 189 right now. So that's plus four, and I'm up to six. What's my current activity level? I'd say I'm moderate, so that's zero. So I'm still at six. What's my goal? I'm trying to lean out. I want to lose body fat, uh, so that's minus two. So that puts me at a four. Uh, so go through and answer those questions for yourself. And now you go to the next page here, <coughs> excuse me, and you figure out how many points you got. So for me, I'm a four. That puts me at plan D. And what that's saying is, oh, goodness sakes, get out of here. Uh, that puts me right in the 2,100 to 2,400 calories per day. And that's actually right where I started my calorie cut, uh, my, my cutting phase. On Monday, I set it for 2,200 and uh, really, if I'm anywhere from 21 to 23, I'm happy. So that's basically right where this plan put me. So, I mean, it can be a good thing to give you a target calorie range. Um, from here, you have a few different options or a couple different options. Uh, I like uh, using my fitness pal to just track whatever I eat and hit specific calorie macro goals. Uh, for myself, I... Um, I've been doing this for about three years and I'm a little more experienced and I'm better with making my own food plan. So I like having the variability that, hey man, you know what? I can I can eat whatever I can fit into my calorie and macro budget. Um, when I'm doing a cut, I eat a lot more fruits and veggies to get my carbohydrate in part because I'm looking for the most volume for my calories. They all, they're also higher in fiber, so I'm on lower calories. It helps keep me full. Um, uh, so, I like the My Fitness Pal. That, <laughs> uh, sorry, um, I like the My Fitness Pal, but the other option you have is oh, sorry, hold on. The other option you have is a container system, and the container system can be a great thing to help you get started if you're not used to tracking your macros. Um, essentially what it does is it gives you the calorie goal and it breaks down um, what you eat here. Uh, so you have these different containers that are going to come with your program, green, purple, red, yellow, blue, and orange. Um, green being vegetables, purple fruit, red protein, yellow starchy vegetables, um, blue um, it's blue. blue is healthy fats and orange is uh, salad dressings and seeds. 
Um, and what it does, you find your plan on this table and on the next page here, and it tells you how many of each container you get in a day, and following that um, method, it's going to pre-portion out your calories and your macros for you, so uh, you're going to be within that calorie range, and it's going to keep your macros pretty good with, I think, probably around a 40-40-20 uh, macro split between protein, carbs, and fat, um, which is a pretty good macro ratio. That's what I kind of like starting with, um, unless you're a little more experienced and want to fiddle with it. So for me, uh, being on plan E, I would get six green containers, uh, four purples, uh, six proteins or reds, four yellows, one blue, and one orange and then six tablespoons and you just divvy that divvy that out through the day and the really good thing I like about this nutrition guide that I think all everyone in here should check out is it gives you a big list of food for all these different categories so for veggies you have kale watercress collard greens spinach pumpkin squash winter squash string beans peppers you know blah, blah not blah 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 but so on all the way down through the list and you just take these you chop them up and you fit them in the container that's a serving uh, same thing for fruits and the purple and everything's nicely color-coded protein so if you're looking for different options on proteins if you're just sick of you know chicken breast and pork loin you know, there's a lot of options here um, yellow starchy carbs uh, blue healthy fats uh, salad dressings and seeds and then all your teaspoons here um, so really dig in, check this out, and it tells you the importance, you know, of different beverages you can have. It can do, tells you the importance of water, coffee, different supplements. Um, I had somebody ask me, how do you work the performance line into the nutrition plan if you're following the, the um, containers? And the thing with the, the performance line of supplements, those are separate and they actually don't count into the container system because they're specifically targeted calories and they're not that many calories. Um, they actually, they say don't even, uh, don't even count those into your container. So it's kind of freebie calories, but they they help with performance. And I've tried the Energize the pre workout, and I like it. It's pretty good. I haven't tried the other ones yet, but I've heard nothing but rave reviews about them. Uh, Shakeology. Someone asked me that counts as a red container, um, unless you start mixing things with it. But if you just take one scoop of Shako by itself. That's one red container. Um, so, and then also you can scroll down and they give different recipes. So, um, you know, almond crusted chicken uh, gives you all the ingredients, the, the recipe to cook it, and it also tells you how many containers it serves. So it's really good and convenient way to find some recipes. Um, yeah, and then you know, from that, vegetable soup, uh, so on and so forth. And these recipes look pretty good. I mean, I'm going to have to try some of these. Ooh, that looks tasty. Um, that looks like they have a breakfast sandwich here. That looks good. It's like kind of playing Eggs Benedict. Um, yeah, so get in here, check it out. You have different options for, um, for nutrition, either, you know, tracking what you eat with my fitness pal or digging into the container systems i think both things are going to work pretty well for you just depending on if you like a little bit more variability um you know my fitness pal be better for that but if you're looking for a boot camp and hey i'm just looking for things to eat and recipe ideas and a really kind of a more rigid plan i think the container system will work really good um so get in check it out i'm ex i'm still excited for this one now it's time for me to go rock my workout uh, I was going to do an X, a P90X3, but I think I got to do a hammer and chisel workout tonight to try something else new. Um, and uh, still using on demand because my program won't get here till Saturday. So on demand it is. All right, guys, you have a fantastic evening and I look forward to seeing all your posts.